Hey guys, my name is Angel. Hi, I'm Joa. And we are Men of Culture. We're going to be watching today what? Jackson on Neverland, episode 10. Yeah. Right now, you guys can see some of the shows that we're watching. Join us. Join the people Join of culture. Join the people of culture. You want your comments? Leave your comments below. How, how are we going to get out of this mess? Uh, how? It's a messy situation here. A cliff? A cliff. A cliffhanger. Cliffhanger. Yeah. Wait, without. What the, what, a way to get it out. Emma is without a leg. Yeah, yeah, no leg. Roman is going to be chipped. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Let's get right into it. Want to find out already. Right, we're going to get right into watching the video. Jack's going to never learn. Episode 10. One, two, three. You know, I mean, Wrong. this has Sipping on straight, Clary. <laughs> this has absolutely nothing to do with Jack School Neverland. But how do you feel about anime, about uh, comedy? That is, I mean, it's not a genius comedy, but it is a funny comedy. Which one? I mean, I'm, I'm just telling you. How would you feel about comedy and anime? Like, like not the one that we see. Like, imagine we're gonna watch an anime that is pure comedy. What do you think? Would you sit through that? Sure, why not? Okay, what about... Maybe, well, One Punch is kind of that. Yeah, One Punch is kind of that, but there's, you know, fighting and everything. Yeah, fighting. Okay, what about a uh, sport anime? Nice, I, I like Captain Tsubasa. I mean, yeah, you you got Captain Tsubasa as a, as, a, as a reference, but there's some other anime about sports that some people have been saying, hey, you know, check it out. Actually, one, one, one person said it very recently. It depends, it depends on which sport. There's one that I myself haven't seen, that a lot of people see, the reactors. And I'm thinking that maybe, maybe it's a good, a good chance to watch the, the particular anime, to be honest. I haven't seen it. Which one? It's called Haikyuu, I believe. Haikyuu? Yeah, it's about volleyball. Oh, oh I like volleyball. Yeah, yeah. Are they girls? I think there are girls, but there's also dudes. Damn, I love volleyball. Okay. Well, of course, it makes sense. Really? What? Through the through the gate, through the gate. It's, it's filled with everything through the gate. ヘイドを挟まで行ってみたんだ。ほう。平和二股に分かれていた。一つは断崖に沿った平。もう一つは僕らのハウスの側面の平。ちょうど60度ずつ。二股の平の内側はまるで対称。そっくり同じ景色が
I had a good life. That, that, that badass. Yeah. He's so badass. He's badass, but... That voice of resignation, dude. It could get worse. Uh, the, the thing they wanted to use to communicate. <laughs> Even Junker Norman. Do not enter. It was in English. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, <laughs> I was able to read it. <laughs> Emma. Emma. Oh, she looks like the, the like 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 the the little guy. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Similar. So normal like uh, Emma for a while, huh? Serious sickness. Well, he has a flu, I guess. Again? <laughs> yeah, she looked right there, exactly as you said, like the other guy. The other kid. Well, they, 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 they were friends since the beginning. Yeah, yeah. So, so Eleven looks really cute to be honest. To think that, that this guy, Ray, know everything. Yeah. From the beginning. Yeah, he knows. He knows it. He knew everything. The only thing. The, the only thing. Oh. What is your plan, Isabella? The G. What is it? You're not stupid. <laughs> the kid feel Yeah, where's Ray? I'm so sorry. Oh, 
For some reason, he sucked off. He will catch her. Well, of course, I guess. A kiss? No, it's a huge, huge. Were they planning this? Oh! Oh my God! The device. I know the device is compromised. Ah, oh, he's gonna say, I love you. Or what? She was gonna say it. He was gonna say it. Mate! Oh! <laughs> This bitch? Damn, this bitch! Mama, I'm going to go to the end of the day. I'm going to go to the end of the day. I'm going to go to the end of the day. I'm going to go to the end of the day. I'm going to What is Ray doing? Nothing, just waiting. Yeah, exactly. She lost the, her composure for a week, for a week. No, it's over. That fucking truck. It's over. The monsters are in there, I guess. 
him, the big one. For a second I thought it was over. Almost. <laughs> I, I thought it was the same. Yeah. It's already the morning. He's already dead. Eleven. <laughs> What's going on? Emma. No. Uh, that boys. She's hallucinating, I guess. Well, not all the species are gone, at least. Yeah, he looks really depressed. Uh, what? Well, yeah, the cliff is kind of a... He's tired of trying, I guess. Oh, his motivation is gone. The face she's making. She wants her to turn it to convert to, to become a mom, to become a mom. Maybe. You just said it. She really, she really gets every dead. Every dead gets her. She's not bad, she's not evil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, I don't know, I don't understand. She's vicious, well. she's... In the, in the system, on the system, yeah. Maybe. Maybe not.
Eleven. Oh, a whole no, month no. and we saw nothing of Norman. He's dead. Well, he's dead, obviously, but... Why? Oh, there's another Norman. <laughs> another Norman. <laughs> another one. They lost all their... their will. Where's Ray? Ray? Probably in the same position. Is that? No, it's not dead. He's, they're just literally. Why is he smiling? January, December. Why is this going so fast? Ray. Damn. Oh, she's walking. Built by the house? Oh, it's birthday. They shipped out on their birthday. So Norman was... October? He, he was uh, shipped before time. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> they were acting. They were acting, of course. What the fuck? They were acting. Okay. I want to point out two things. They didn't show us Norman dying, and also they show us Maybe Norman was... looking kind of impressed. Uh, at something before, before he, he was kind of like scared first when 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 uh, Mom was when Isabella was opening the door, and then instead of like uh, uh, more being more scared that the monsters were there, for example, he looked like rather impressed or something like something different, right? Like like he, his look was not of, of despair like Chrome, for example, that Chrome was like fuck, I'm done, like this is it, right? Uh, yeah. It was completely different, so... I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. you should look this. Go that's... Strong. that's so Oh, yeah. Now, the three kids. Crown. Oh my god, this is so confusing. <laughs> This is very confusing. I don't know what's going on. I have no idea now. I think... I still believe that Isabella is not entirely bad, bad or in the system. Oh. I think that she wants to find a way to help the kids to be free. Like, maybe not, not Emma and, 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 and Ray and Norman, of course. Like, maybe not them, but, but in the future, working as a mother, trying to get in inside the, the system to try to figure it out a way. I mean, try to figure out. That's the only reason. But but she's not trying. Oh well, she's she's looking. For, she's trying to figure out how to get them out. Yeah, yeah. But how to get away? Yeah, how to get away? But but she doesn't. Well, she gets uh, hit with every da with, with every dent. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Of but course. but she doesn't take it as. Too much. He doesn't take it too much. Well, because it, uh, it's, it's happening over and over and over again. Yeah, again. because it, it's a cycle. As, yeah, as, yeah. As she said, it's a cycle. So she's how many years? 31, 32? Yeah. Something among the lines. Um, so she's been experiencing this for a while. She just resigned a little bit. Maybe she's still she's still working, but she just resigned. She just has she just has this resignation for for for, for what's going on. Yeah, yeah. It happens, it's a cycle, as you said. 
but maybe within the cycle she's still trying to yeah to to, to find a way maybe she's trying she's to find trying. a way I, I she tried to escape that, that's my main reason for me saying that she tried to escape she saw she couldn't because of the cliff and uh, she just gave up of course not she's super smart as well she, mm. she's she's a rival for for these guys for these kids as well as well so uh, i don't i don't believe she's entirely evil well or rather consumed by the system because in, in, in their particular uh, situation, you don't really become evil just because you're sending the kids to the monsters. It's your fucking job. You have no other option. It's either that or you get, get killed yourself. So uh, she's just following the system. But I still believe that she within the system is trying to do something. I, I, I really don't believe that she's just like, yeah, kids, you're gonna die. Have happy lives and whatever. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. And also, when, 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 when Norman was walking with her and she was like, well, you're not carrying a lot of things, huh? She was like, well, are you happy? And she lost it. She lost it for a second. She lost it for a second and then went back. Yeah, I'm happy, whatever. But, but she lost it. So I, I doubt that. I think these are clues. These are clues that, that she's not just there living, waiting to see the day that she dies naturally. That's it. No, no, I think she's trying to do something. What? I have no idea. Yeah. I mean, we had the hypothesis that maybe she had uh, uh, fed this guy, this, these kids to a point in which there would be uh, some kind of poison within them that the one, the, the him was going to consume. But I have no idea now. At this point, I have no idea. Because they rushed Norman to begin with. So, what? I have no idea. I really have no idea. This was a very confusing episode, even though it was so clear that, well, Norman was being shit. Yeah. So, okay. They were pretending to be the press then. Maybe second season we're gonna watch Emma as a mom. Do you think? Yeah. That would be quite the skip. That would be quite the skip, to be honest. And, but I wonder what could Emma do. I mean, Isabella is probably smarter than Emma. Yeah, try, trying to get best kid. Yeah, high quality kids. I mean, basically what, what Isabella is doing. The whole generation. Isabella just have three. Well, maybe, yes. Maybe Emma started, this is going to be six of these. Oh, I wonder if that is the deal. Like with the generations, because we're trying to get kids to a level in which there is an entire group. Yeah, and, and, they, they, and maybe, maybe, maybe one of them will get out. Maybe or all of them. Maybe they will make it. Well, they have to go to her quarters, get in and then try to survive the monsters that are inside. Yeah, but imagine, three super kids against monsters is almost impossible, but maybe with six and the bunch of the other kids? I don't know, I think that it doesn't matter how smart you are, if there is a, a monster. It matters, it matters. Maybe... If, I mean, what are they going to use to... By, by that time, maybe that they will be able to gather more information well, with probably. six brains, with six super kids, or, or even ten kids. Yeah, yeah. yeah but they, imagine, they this. Gather morning imagine this. Imagine this. It's a facility, like a farm. There's a lot of people, a lot of scientists, a lot of monsters who are keeping us guards. And I, this has this, this as an escape has never happened. We assume as an escape, an escape has never happened. So, uh, and we know that these monsters are massive. Like Kron was super, super tall. She was a tiny thing in comparison with one of the monsters. Yeah. So what the kids are gonna do? They they're gonna get slapped and killed in the process. Like, what weapons can they use? That is the problem. Poison, poison them. Maybe just throwing powder. Oops. I don't know. To be honest, it's a it's a complicated situation. We're we're probably we're probably thinking too ahead. To did, be you, honest. did you notice that they make emphasis on on when Norman was sick? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Maybe bacteria. Maybe a bacteria. A yeah, bacteria. yeah. Maybe it's, bacteria. It's our biggest hypothesis that, that that maybe Isabella has been breeding these kids, in particular, to be poison for him. So we don't really know. And at this point, I think it's gonna take more than this season to to, yeah, to get the conclusion to, to get, get to get to an actual conclusion. But I believe that maybe the ending of this season is going to be. Uh, a cliffhanger. <laughs> a cliffhanger? <laughs> but what, someone is going to die. Uh, you... Again. Either Isabella yeah. is going to die, 
either Emma or, no, or Norman, although we think Norman's already dead, but I think he might not be dead. Mr. Yet. Dead. Yet. He might be he might be being like a pet right now. This guy is Hades. Why? <laughs> I don't know, you always want people to die. Because the death of characters give relevance and, and give way to, to a show. Someone has to die. Fido yeah, yeah. has to die. Yeah, yeah. Norman has to die. If no character dies... Rai has to die. In a show that is trying to take itself seriously... Goku has to die. He died a lot of times. Twice. Yeah, yeah. But, but what I'm saying... A, a death is not necessarily, entirely. But what I'm trying to say is that when there's a, a show in which death is a possibility... If there's no death, then was death even a possibility to begin with? No. No. It, it takes away from the story, from the risk, from the from the from the fear of, of someone actually uh, dying. So that's what I'm trying to say, and that's what I think. Maybe someone has to die. We just got a new subscriber. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Official crowd. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah. Do you have anything else to say? No. Right. I'm just waiting for the next episode. The next episode. You might be right. You might be right what but you said. The no. next episode will be a mind blower. Yeah, yeah, you might be right. Anyways, we're really gonna be seeing you guys next time. See ya.